and welcome back to the K Darlings YouTube channel. This is Chair Dancing with BJ, and today I am reacting to Henry's new music video. Called I Love You. Henry, I love you too. If you guys have watched me for any extended period of time, you may have heard me talk about Henry from time to time. Normally there's a photo, framed photo right here, but it's right here. Yes, I have a framed photo of Henry in my office. I do, because I love Henry that much. Henry is one of my favorite artists, period. K-pop, not K-pop, it don't matter. Henry is one of my favorites. I admire Henry, and it's not just that I find Henry incredibly attractive, because I do find him incredibly attractive. Um, yes, I know he's going to be 30 this year, and yes, I know I'm old enough to be his mother, sort of. I mean, if I was a mother in my teen years, but the point is this. I find Henry's talent extremely attractive, and here's why. Here's Let me give you a little information on Henry if you don't know much about Henry. Uh, he's re uh, His name is Henry Lau, but he just strictly goes by Henry. Uh, he's actually Canadian. He is, his father is Chinese, his mother is Taiwanese. Um, he will be 30 this year in November, but he is not only a singer, um, he's a singer, he's a dancer, he is a musician, he plays, what is it, five instruments? Um, he can speak, I think it's six languages. Uh, he's also a songwriter, a composer, he's an actor, he's been on multiple variety shows, he's actually currently on a variety show in Korea, in South Korea, um, but he's also done, he's done movies. He's done a, a South Korean TV series. Most recently, you may have seen him in the Steven Spielberg movie, um, A Dog's... Was it, no, the first one was A Dog's Purpose. What was it? A Dog's Journey. Um, he plays he plays the, the male lead in in uh, the romantic lead in that movie, if you guys have seen it. And then if some of you have seen that and were aware of who Henry is, you're right now you're going, oh, that's Henry. Yes, that's Henry. Um, and he started off, actually, in a subunit of Super Junior, which, of course, we all know at this point that Super Junior is my first love in K-pop and my favorite K-pop group. Um, he started off in Super Junior M, and he started with them in 2008. Um, and, yeah, so he's just, he's absolutely amazing. I love Henry so much, it's ridiculous. Um, hence, I have a framed photo of Henry in my office. Okay. He's also got a big, like, historical epic uh, movie coming out. I think it's Chinese in 2020. Um, I can't remember the name of it right now, but I'll definitely be seeing it. So anyway, that's Henry Lau, and uh, he dropped his new song um, maybe a week ago, uh, but I have not listened to it because I had a feeling he was going to drop a music video for it, and he has. So I'm going to go ahead and react to that right now, and I am ridiculously excited. My favorite OST from any K-drama is It's You from While You Were Sleeping. It's like, it's, While You Were Sleeping is my number one K-drama, my favorite K-drama of all time. And It's You is my favorite OST of all time, and it just happens to be from my favorite, favorite K-drama. If you guys have not listened to that song, it's all in English. And it's amazing. And it's one of those songs that feels like what love should be. It's just, I can't even do it justice. So yeah, you guys need to go and check that out. All right. We are going to go ahead and check out I Love You by Henry in three, two, one, play. I've been waiting. <sighs> Ooh. 
Oh. He's still hung up on his ex, but he's with someone else. Oh, his voice. Dear Lord. Oh. God, Henry. Oh, dear Lord. Okay. Um, goosebumps. I had goosebumps through that whole thing. I actually started to get all emotional there for a moment. <laughs> this is not your typical breakup song. Those lyrics. Did you guys see those lyrics? Those lyrics. Okay. So how many times it, like you, you were in a relationship with somebody and you were so in love, so in love and you break up, but you, you cannot get over that person. Like you just, you can't and you end up somehow you end up maybe in a rebound relationship with someone who actually reminds you of your ex as a way to help you cope. But yet you are still so completely hung up on that person because you're still in love with them. Like they've moved on, but you just can't. And that feeling, somehow Henry captured that feeling of, oh my God, I cannot let go. I love this person so much that, and you know, he even made that comment that I want to go back to you tonight. I want to, I want, I want to be with you, even though I've got someone else next to me. Oh my God. I mean, I shouldn't like this song just for that aspect, but I do. Um, Henry, if you need, um, Volunteers, I volunteer as tribute. Um, wow, that song was, Henry is like the king of frickin' ballads. Like, he can do a ballad like nobody else. His voice is so, his voice is like silk. It just, it's, oh, God, I love Henry so much. This song was everything. This song was everything. As much as I loved It's You, because like I said, It's You feels like what love should be. This song, I Love You, feels like every breakup that you've gone through that you didn't want, like where you're the one who, who got dumped, but yet you can't move on. This song was, wow. And his, his vocals through the whole thing. Henry's not a powerful voc vocalist. He's not this 
powerful, you know, like ballad singer. He, but his voice is just, it's perfect. I don't even know how else to describe it. This song was everything. And the video, I don't know if you guys, have you guys ever heard of suit porn? <laughs> um, it's where a man can really wear a suit and just be like, wow. Uh, Henry knows how to wear a suit. There was some serious suit porn in this video. And just, well, Henry's visuals too. The older he gets, the, the more handsome he becomes. Um, seriously, if you guys have never checked out Henry's music, check out everything he's ever done and watch his progression and watch his maturity. He composes everything. He plays all of his own instruments. Most of this stuff that you're listening to, he's written, he's composed, he's singing, and he's possibly, probably also done all of the instrumentals in the background. And he's, he's, he's produced it as well. I can guarantee he's done most of that himself. 95%, if not 100% of this was all Henry. Um, he's extremely talented and he's also extremely humble. He's very funny and um, uh, he's very charismatic. He's got a very, a very sweet, serious side to him and he's got a very funny kind of um, mischievous side to him. Um, and I love both of those. I just, I love everything about Henry, you guys. I really do. If I was 15 years younger and went to Korea, I still wouldn't stand a chance, but you know, I'd give it a shot. I'm sorry. I'm kidding. I love you, honey. My husband. Hi. Um, anyway, Henry, guys, seriously, check out the original video that's in the description. Uh, this is going on my ballad playlist that I play at bedtime. Um, this is going on my favorites. This is, this is going on my writing playlist. You guys, this is going on all of them. Holy cow, Henry. Oh, I want to watch it again, but I can't because I got to go take my daughter to work right now. So anyway, that's it for me, guys. Um, thanks again for stopping in. I hope you guys are checking out all of the videos and discovering new music um, in all genres in all countries. So anyway, that is it for me. Until next time, guys. Bye.